Number five, potassium. Referring to the periodic table, you see that potassium is atomic number 19. So right now we're assuming that that is also the number of electrons. So that's going to be 19 electrons to account for. In order to satisfy the off bow principle, I have my sublevels with uh, the appropriate number of orbitals uh, sketched out from left to right okay, in terms of increasing energy level. So that'll, that'll uh, satisfy the off bow principle. As I go through and I fill orbitals with electrons, I make sure that I fill them with opposite spins. Okay, electrons with opposite spins. That's going to satisfy the Pauli exclusion principle. As I come to any sublevel that has more than one orbital, I make sure I fill each orbital singly, meaning with one electron, before I go back and double any of them up. Then I can move to the next orbital. One, two, three. All right, go back and double up. So let's double check. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. One more. Nineteenth electron goes in the four s. In the four s. Now, in terms of the electron configuration notation, uh, potassium has two electrons in the one s, two electrons in the two s, six electrons in the two p, uh, two electrons in the three s, six electrons in the three. And then one electron. That's potassium.